Hey, what's up, everyone? It's Leo here again, and as you guys might have noticed, I'm not an English speaker, I'm from Brazil. But I'll try my best, though, to make another video on Rainbow Six Siege. Today, let's talk about the smoke grenade. This item is very underestimated, especially among the casual players. In general, people would rather go for the breach charge or stun grenade over the smoke one. When I started to play this game, I used to have this choice as well. Now, I have seen how incredible the smoke grenade is. And I have watched some Pro League matches and the Pro teams, they use it all the time. Unfortunately, it's a shame that only four operators are equipped with the smoke grenade. Only Ash, Montagne, Glass and Blitz have it. At least one player in your team should have a smoke grenade. It's technical because it helps you to join a rune, it blinds the enemies and gives you a mobility to surprise them. It also gives you a safe path when you have multiple entrances. For example, here, at the right side, you could have enemies waiting to kill you. Throwing a smoke grenade right there at the door opens a gap for you to run. The enemies would not see you when you're moving. Another example here, you can close more than one enemy field of view to move safely. It's very helpful, especially when you're in a rush, when your time is about to end. When you are playing defend the area, besides to help you to get in the room, if you kill the enemies that are inside, it will force the roamers to come back inside to contest it. If you are already inside, throw the smoke grenades at the doors to blind the defenders. They will be in a rush and they won't have time to wait the smoke disappear. They will get in this parade and you will be waiting for them, so it will give you a lot of advantage on hostage. You can throw smoke grenade on the hostage, no one would dare to shoot towards him. IQ, for example, could see through the smoke, grab the hostage and run away. It's really sneaky tactic. I've done a couple times and it has worked. On bomb, I would say it's the best strategy. It gets even better when you have a shoot at the team. Throw a couple smokes to build a blind. The shoot move forward to provide cover to the team. Another player might carry the bomb and plant it right behind him. This is the safest strategy to plant a bomb that I've seen so far on Rainbow Six Siege. On Pro League, this play is very common. Sometimes you gotta be aware to C4, but normally the defenders don't know exactly where the attackers are in the middle of all that smoke. My friend Andrew and I did a great job here. I threw two smoke grenades at the doors. My teammate was hidden in the smoke. The enemies came towards me and didn't even notice him. That killed them all. And of course, we won the round. Again guys, the smoke grenade is a very terrible play. That's it for today's video fellas, I hope this video has helped you somehow. If it did, please hit the like button and subscribe at the channel. There is much more coming up. Have a good one and bye amigos. Now watch me nae nae, okay. now watch me whip, whip, watch me nae nae